Step 10. Now, this is the step that's going to make your kids think you are magical. Curling ribbon. You're going to do about two lengths of white curling ribbon. Similarly, you're going to do about two lengths of red curling ribbon. Now, with curling ribbon, you don't have to worry about cutting it at an angle because it's not made out of fabric, so you don't have to worry about it fraying later on. What I want you to do now is take your ribbon and you're just going to fold it right at the end to make a nice little point. Whatever the center of your garland ends up being, and because mine only has three hearts, the center heart is right here in the middle of the three, and you're going to pull your curling ribbon, if you can, I promise I'm an expert at this, right through the center. All right, there we go. Beautiful. Now you're going to tie your curling ribbon just like so and make a nice pretty bow right here in the middle. And this is fun because your kids can help you with this. Have them put their finger right in the middle of the bow. Kids love to do that. All right, now we've got our beautiful bow right in the center. Here comes the magic. This is going to get you huge brownie points. <coughs> awesome. It looks so great. Do the same with the white. Do it with the other white one. Oh, and it makes a really cool sound that kids love. And the other red one. And voila. You have a super cute, super fun, easy to make, inexpensive heart garland.